Hi everyone and welcome to today's ASMR video. Today I'll be doing another classic hardcore session including traveling, um, doing some quests, a bit of professions and selling here and there. So just your average classic thank you person playing session basically so i hope that you guys will find this video relaxing i'm gonna do my best to not die and keep it relaxing <laughs> so thank you so much for watching i hope you'll enjoy today's video so let's get started this is my rogue it's still my first official hardcore character um I'm currently level 33, playing a human rogue. I went to uh, Gadget Sand to log off and get the rest of the XP. Um, so yeah, that's that basically. I have mill, probably some auction house stuff. Okay. Before I leave this town, I want to see if I can buy some stuff for my rogue poisons and um, if I can uh, cook a little bit. Can't seem to find a fire. So I'm just gonna. Oh, there's one here. Okay, let's see if. Yeah, they're, they're not selling spices. I need spices. So I'm just gonna do a quick run. See if there's like a vendor that might sell that. If not, it's all good. No. And then I'll just drop some stuff in my bank and I'll be off doesn't look like what I need is here um I don't think the no, doesn't look like the butcher has it I'm gonna turn off the dialogue sounds okay so all good I will drop some of my stuff in here. My bank is full. Amazing. That's all good. I know that there's an auction house here. I think it's faction shared. It's like in, uh, in Booty Bay. It's like a shared auction house, I believe. I'm gonna put this in here for I don't know wild. Let's try to sell this. Um, I don't know if this sells. To be honest, I think this is a bad a bad bet. I don't think you should put much in this auction house. It's not really worth it. I also think. Okay, we're gonna be continuing without doing that. So I'm level 33, I'm about to hit 34. And um, I was leveling a bit in Thousand Needles. It's not the most interesting zone in my opinion, but I do like that it's mostly killing quests, looting quests, it's a lot of beasts, I'm getting a lot of leather because I have skinning and leather working and um, I just want to over level a bit by clearing this I'll be around level 34 and then I can um, 
finish up some quests in wetlands i can start doing some stuff in um hill hill spread and by the time i'm gonna be doing things in arethi highlands maybe stranglethorn and desolus i'll be well into the level 30s because i don't like going to these zones when i just hit level 30 that's just way too tight that's not safe on hardcore so I like to over level it makes everything easier and um, safer in case I pull two mobs it's not the end of the world I have a bit of a level buffer so to say so yeah I'm gonna eat this gooey spider cake sounds delicious it's gonna give me a 15 uh, spirit and 6 stamina boost and then I will apply my poison I'm running out a bit but that's fine I just want to finish up these quests so these are all a little bit on the higher end in terms of level but I just really want to finish up this quest so I'm gonna try to kill one see how hard or how easy that goes because i just need six of them you know and that way i can just be done with this quest i think i can do this it's not too bad so that was one out of six there's two more here it's gonna be fine make sure to distract it and they give me heavy leather I still need medium leather a bit but if they give me like in between heavy and medium I think that's pretty good and this way I'm kind of stocking up on heavy leather already which is not a bad Another salt stone gazer. Oh. I got spotted. It's really easy to get spotted in vanilla. Stealth is not as OP. So. No, 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 no. Oh, okay, that's only five seconds. That's fine. I don't like it when mobs give you debuffs that last forever. A bit of a of first aid, no bandage. Okay. So yeah, with this zone I feel like Blizzard didn't really outdo themselves. <laughs> Like, what is this? This is just a sad sound. But it is very nice XP. I really like these killing quests. Okay, we've got three here, which is exactly the amount that I need. Oh, okay, well, someone just stole my kill. If that's how I can call it. Oh, well, it's fine. There's uh, quite a few. gonna go for this one together so I gotta be careful I'm just gonna go for this oh okay go for this one 
It's the last one I need, so it's all good. Then I need um I need three more salty scorpid venom. I already started this quest, I just need to kill um scorpions for that. So I'll be doing that now. And then I've got a quest with the vultures left. And if I completed that one, then I've done all the the racing game here. Or the racing. <laughs> then I've uh, completed all. So I'll be going... I'm, I'm racing, actually. No, I'm going to the other side. The more you go north, the lower level these are. I've got a quest for Stormwind also. It's level 26. I don't know. The drop rate is disappointing, so I don't know if I should really try to finish that quest per se. I will just go and do this. It's another drop quest though, so I don't know what the drop rate is of these vulture bones. I need 10 of them, so it's quite a bit, so I really hope it's not a very low drop rate. Because that's uh, gonna be painful. <laughs> okay. I got one. So there were supposed to be scorpions around here. I saw a lot of them yesterday. I guess they all got killed, just like this person. Well, either I'm very lucky or the drop chances, drop rate is not too bad. Um, okay, there's a scorpion. Took a bit before I found one. I see three, four, okay. I only need three more venoms, so let's hope that they drop quickly so that I can move on to a nicer zone. It's also nice that you can skin the scorpions. Most of them give heavy leather. One over there. Not the best drop rate. <laughs> as long as you have rested XP, I really don't mind this because it's it's a nice way to um get a bit of extra XP relatively easily by just killing mobs it did give me a, um, a poison that lasts 3 minutes and does damage and reduces strength and agility it's like all the things I don't want I also use first aid so this is painful, you can't heal yourself I um I want just want to finish this quest as quickly as I can. Okay.
Even stealth is a struggle because of this poison. So yeah, I'm getting towards the higher levels now. I'm over halfway. Things are slowing down. But I try to just really play casually. And um... Not too long sessions because... You don't have that much rested XP. I'll just eat this. The only thing I can do now is eat and I don't have much food. I mostly have food for the buffs. Okay. Good enough. Now. See a few more scorpions. Let's hope that they're finally gonna drop. The item. I've been a bit unlucky so far. Very unlucky. Oh, this thing stacks. Oh my goodness, you can have it both. That's wild. Okay. So at the moment, my leatherworking hit 155. So I should check if there's going to be any nice new recipes that I can learn, or patterns, I should say. So I can uh, craft some nice gear for myself. I still have a cloak from level level 13 cloak. <laughs> and my weapons are not too good. I should get new weapons. Okay, one of my poisons ran out. It goes really quick. So in classic, in vanilla, your poison as a rogue is not only timed, it also has charges, and that's for the uh, instant poison. And each hit has a chance to use a charge and do poison damage. So if you're just constantly fighting, If you're constantly fighting, then um, your poison goes quick. That's why I only have six left. Yeah, this is just stupid. I can't kill any more scorpions for a while. I need to wait for this to um, run out. And I don't have any anti-venom. Only a lower level one, but that's not useful for me at the moment, so... I'm just gonna fight this lower level basilisk. I still need four scales for the Stormwind quest, but... I don't know, I'm not gonna focus on that. If I happen to finish it, it's nice, but... It's not a priority. This stacking poison is just <laughs> wild. <laughs> it's insane how dangerous that can be. So 
so that's four out of ten I'm gonna check um, my fishing level it's 119 so I'm a little bit behind with my fishing skills so I think that can be a nice thing to do if I find a good spot to fish I don't really know actually so it seems a bit empty but I will skin leather for me I'm about to hit 34 I'll be going to main city not too long after that see how like what my new skills are what I'm gonna lose all my money on again one quest to turn in so I'm just gonna be doing that and I hope I can find some mobs along the way so yeah it's it's crazy how this zone in retail is just full of water this is one big lake in retail and you need to do this little quest to get a boat and you can like sail around or ride around um yeah i'm just gonna turn in the quest didn't go to the flight path Probably fine to get here from the parents or uh, through Tenaris. Next time I want to go here, I should just go to um, Dustwallow Marsh. Oh yeah, leveled up. I'm gonna be picking a talent uh, I'm gonna finish off my dual wield specialization is increasing my damage done by my offhand weapon by 50% in total which I think is pretty good so this quest just turned gray for me so i'm gonna be getting rid of that did it remove the items i think it did did it yeah so i still have a few quests left um I'll be doing that another time. For now, I need to go to Iron Forge because that's where my Hearthstone is at. And then we're going to be going to Stormwind, learn my new abilities, and um, then I'm going to be going to my next questing zone. I don't know where I want to be questing next yet. I will put some stuff on the auction house I don't know how well this sells do people buy mystery meat? okay, doesn't sell too well I would think it um, it would sell because hunters need to feed their pets, but apparently. 
Wait, is there an event right now? Honoring a hero? I'm gonna have a look. Perhaps not. Maybe it's just the add-on. Doesn't look like it, right? Usually there's a whole feast, like table and food. Oh, is it? Oh, there is? Okay. That's nice. I think it's a event where you honor fallen soldiers and you need to go to Uther's tomb or something like that. Travel to Uther's tomb. <laughs> what did I just say? Western Plague Lands. Yeah, well. Not really sure if that's going to be something we'll be doing. But hey, I'll honor him in my thoughts. Okay. So, we're going to be going to the tram. I barely fly from Iron Forge to Stormwind. I really don't think it's worth it. It costs you something and it just takes forever. The only time I would probably skip um, the tram and just fly is if I need to be doing something and I just want to be doing something on my other screen. Then it's nice because you don't need to pay attention. I just missed the one here, so I was gonna come here. As a kid, I would always follow this little guy. I was just so impressed by this NPC living its own life, regardless of what I'm doing. I always just followed him around and... Thank you. I also observed this thing a lot of times. I thought it made sense to the tram, but it's completely unrelated. It's completely random, but I still looked at it and thought it was an actual thing. <laughs> and I do remember jumping off of here. I was just curious what was gonna happen and I jumped and then I was like, oh no, I need to walk all this way. And I walked and it took so long. And I guess we've all stared at this aquarium. Nessie is there. I know there's like a lady, lady fash looking thing too. It's actually quite interesting to um, observe. Okay, so we're almost there. I've got a few quests to turn in here, I think, too. And um, then I want to do a little bit of leather working. I still have a lot of No More Gun quests, but I'm hesitant to do it. I've done Dead Mines, I've done Stockade. Black Fathom Deeps, and I think that's it, but I'm scared. Morbin Spain, oh okay, Morbin Fell, I haven't done that yet. But yeah, I'm scared, I feel like No Morgan has too many tricky moments. If people don't know what they're doing, you're gonna die. And, I mean, I survived all the other dungeons. It, it was fine, but I'm still scared. I don't know. No more gun is tricky. I could really, really, really use the leather pants, though. Ah, uh, but yeah.
I don't need that, but thank you so much for the healing offhand. Very nice and useful. Oh man, I can't level up my first aid. I'm just a little too low. Okay, so I'll go to the bank. I'll pick up my leatherworking stuff. And I'll be doing a bit of leather working. And I'll cook a few goblin deviled clams just because I can. I have no idea how much of this I need But I'll just grab it So I have six levels left And I currently have 34 gold I need to be at 90 for a month there's no way, there's no way I managed to do it on classic, vanilla classic back in the days, like what, four or three years ago I had enough gold on my Knight of Rogue by the time I hit level 40 My trick was, um, I just pickpocketed everything And I was questing in Stranglethorn, so I I got a lot of leather from skinning and I pickpocketed all the humanoids and that really helped a lot Okay, I'm gonna make heavy leather uh, Should I actually? Wait I'm gonna do some uh, cured heavy hide And I can make five of these. Six, no, five, okay. So, I do admit that I often look up a classic leatherworking guide just to see what they recommend you to level because I can get there but it might not be super efficient I might like waste a lot of materials so um, Let's have a look. Okay, that's not really what I need. Is there anything I can use actually? I'm gonna put some heavy armor kits on my armor actually. Like, why not? Um. So they do recommend doing this until level 180 So, um... Oh, I don't need salt so. 
and this goes quick if you create if you're crafting armor pieces it goes really slow at some point I am curious what I can train if there's anything useful for me it does look a bit disappointing I guess now I just need patterns that drop and stuff okay I'm gonna put this on my chest and my boots and my hands not legs yeah legs too Got some extra armor, never hurts. Extra protection. Okay, now. I'm gonna. Okay, no ambush. Sprint. 60%, that's nice. Blind, oh my goodness. I got blind. That is so nice. There's been a few times where I wish I had blind. Um, blinding powder. Wait, what? Where do I get blinding powder? I don't remember. Is it a thing that you need to get from the... I know you could get it from lockboxes and at some point I got a lot of it just by pickpocketing and opening these lockboxes but I didn't know that was the only way I can't just buy it like that's the way for me to get it that's wild I'm gonna be doing some cooking now. It's not a lot, but gotta make those deviled clams. I think like cooking is another thing that I feel like. You can only get new nice recipes from quests and stuff. At this point, I can't learn anything interesting anymore. But there might be higher level cook cooking trainers somewhere. I don't know. I'm actually, out of curiosity, just going to check the auction house. So. I'm gonna dip. And I'll check the auction house. And in terms of fishing, Desolus, oh yeah, my favorite song. It is nearby where I want to go though, so. I don't know why I walked like this, I just got a uh, brain fart. Okay, 
putting these on. Same for this. I'm just seeing if people buy this. Um. I'm just gonna look like this because I'm curious. Uh, recipe for cooking. Buzzard wing. Not that many. It's a bit disappointing. How about leatherworking? A guardian belt. What do I have? Not what I was better, I guess. Deviate skill, I am um, all the ingredients I don't have. Okay, so there's quite a few things. I guess I should should do more dungeons so that these can drop. Now, I just need to go and do this quest, and then I might do a low level one in Arathi and then move back here, but they do say that hill spread is 20 to 30, but not for us, like, th this is a much higher level. I feel like that's just for a horde. I will probably finish up the quests here, and um, I'll have to start going to Desolus and do these quests. Maybe by then I can start going to Dust Wallow. It is definitely slowing down at this point. You're in a bit of an awkward in-between stage with leveling. But I will not do that for this video because it will be too long. I think this was a good session to end everything with. So I'm going to end this video here. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. Happy playing if you also play and be careful. And I see you guys next time.